Hey guys, my name is Elise Ivy from Rockney Pickleball. Joey, I want to thank you so much for doing a review and testing out the Rockney Aeroblade. I'm really excited to see what you had to say about it and how you enjoyed the new technology. Thanks, Elise. Rockney, Source Republic in America. It has a tactical carbon. I was at the APP, so a ton of people playing with it. You get a lot of spin. And now for the main event. And I was blown away. When I hit, it grips extremely quick, a lot quicker than the average paddle. This is the first game I played with it. And look what I do. I have to show you. Pretty cool, right? Let's see it one more time in slow motion. Once I open the box, it looked like an object that should be in the Batmobile. And I have to say it is cool. It is sleek. It puts mad spin. Here's a couple points, right? Big serve. But what I found, it can grip extremely well. I can't do that with many paddles at all, let alone an edgeless one. Incredible, right? Beautiful dinks. Look how much spin and my misdirections work. It's a misdirection changer. I know. And I have to say, it holds up extremely well. The second game, it's unbreakable, right? I've broken paddles that way. Here's a couple more. I'm getting mad spin on those dinks, right? And this is beautiful right here. This is my patented shot. This is why I think pros will love it. That. What am I saying? I'm saying Tyson McGovern probably should have waited. He would have really loved this paddle instead of going to Yola and having no rivalry with Ben Johns, although he can never really beat Ben Johns anyway. It grips so well, so quick. I think the pros would really like it. Those quick strokes with this paddle is unstoppable. In my mind, Rockney has fired a bullet at Selkirk and Yola. I think people will try to copy it. And people say it's a male dominated world. Here's Elise, owner of Rockney, doing what she's supposed to do. All right, Joey, it's time to get to the technology of the Aeroblade. So let's do it. So when you order the Aeroblade, this is how it comes. Beautifully boxed with a magnetic closure and voila. You have all of your information in here. You can go to the Rockney website. You can quickly learn about some of the features uh, that are in the paddle. Um, then you're going to notice that you have a really beautiful cover and case here. This is a vegan leather. Sometimes we call it an eco leather case. It does come with your weight system here. You've got three dampeners and this little hole, this is where your edge tape is. But I have already applied the edge tape to this paddle because it is going to be the most important thing that you do when you get this paddle. So the first thing I want you to do is admire it. And then the second thing I want you to do is apply your edge tape. This is two years in the making, four generations later, and here we have it today. We are so proud of what we've been able to create, and trust me, we are not the experts on everything. We did hire incredible engineers, consultants, and material experts in order to make this paddle the best possible experience for you. It's essentially a three-piece construction in a uni build, and I'll get into that as we go through the paddle. But the first thing you're probably noticing is those three holes. So these holes, make this incredibly aerodynamic for one, but for two, this is a face weight dampening system. It's patent pending and it's toolless. The paddle starts at 8.5 ounces. So you decide if you wanna weight the paddle at all, you can just enjoy the technology of this paddle on its own with zero weight whatsoever, and you're gonna have a well-balanced 8.5 ounce paddle. Every time you add in a dampener, it's adding in a half ounce. So you could add one in the center and make it a nine ounce paddle. You could add two on the sides here, or you could add all three, making this a 10 ounce paddle. We'll get to this and I'll show you how you're gonna put this in without any tools whatsoever and feel confident that it's gonna stay in in just a moment. But let me take you through the rest of the paddle first. Okay, so let's talk power. We know this is a 19 millimeter paddle, right? So that means that you're gonna have a ton of control, great touch with this paddle, but we didn't wanna lose power. You're going to have the option to weight this and get more static weight, thus getting more power, but we wanted to take it a step further. So we implemented what's called a power spine. We actually have a piece that goes up the handle and into this bottom part of the paddle here, giving the paddle more power. The next piece that's really special is we took a carbon tube and put it around the paddle here on the inside. Then we injected that part with foam. 
Why? We want a structure to the paddle. We wanted to enhance the sweet spot of the paddle. And then we have an incredible core in here as well. Hypervelocity power poly core really helps with the impact of the ball. And I think you'll really enjoy that for the control aspect. And again, you've got that 19 millimeters, which is always gonna help out with control. And now let's talk about the carbon. Three layers of carbon, triple layer of carbon, so tri-layered, and then on top of the tri-layer, we applied a, a 3K and an applied grit as well. So I wanna just show you real quickly how you're going to change the weights without any tools. You're just gonna use your thumbs. Now, it's called a friction fit in engineering. Let me stand up here and show you. I like to take the paddle and anchor it against my body here, and then I take the dampener, and I'm going to position it right there and then I'm going to give it a little push. I'm pushing with both of my thumbs. I make sure that the lip is around it there. And then I make sure, see the lip is not all the way out here, so I'm gonna push it a little bit further. You see how that popped out? And now I have it, the lip is all the way out there and the lip is all the way out there. So I just added a half ounce to this paddle. So I took it from an 8.5 to a nine ounce right there. Now you've got two more of these. We do sell these separately. We also sell the edge tape separately as well. This is, uh, this is it, Joey. This is our two year in the making. Pretty cool, Elise. Here's some more points of me playing. Then we'll go back to Elise and she's gonna give you the rock me line. Good pop, right? Good counters. And you can watch my extension, backhand roll, it works, big serve, nice drops right, puts good spin, good misdirections. And one other thing, I get really good pop with this paddle, but it's not too poppy. I can still reset. And I just want to mention, save 10% on any paddle. If you go to Rock Me, enter Pirates, save 10%. If you want another paddle, look in the description. This is literally all I do, and it keeps me in business. But I have to say, I was thoroughly impressed with Rock Me's new toy. I think many others will too. One other thing, I can really hit my spots without swinging too hard while putting spin on it. Does that make sense? I can hit my spots, especially when I'm at the kitchen, and I don't have to exert too much energy. That's what I'm trying to say. So if I'm in a really long tournament, I would much rather this paddle, where I could do quicker strokes, put more spin, expend less energy, right? And win. And that forehand reset I just hit, that could have really popped up, but it didn't with this paddle, and I was extremely happy it didn't, because I would play in a tournament with it, and I might switch to it. In the coming weeks, I will try the weights. This is a first impression, people. Leave your comments, I will try to answer once I play more. We're also gonna have game tape of me playing with it. We have it every morning. Don't forget to subscribe. And whatever paddle you buy, save 10%. Back to Elise. Aeroblade technology, which is the fourth pillar of our paddle pillars and we've got that sub 100 line we've got our raw carbon thermoform line we've got our made in the usa line and we've got our advanced technology line which now includes the rockney aeroblade 1.19 so keep this in your beautiful case of course and uh, think about this for yourself or as a gift for someone because it does come so beautifully um, boxed for you as well so we hope that you guys enjoy this and that it helps improve your game and that you have even more fun out on the court because you've got the right tool in your hand so thank you so much for watching and Joey really appreciate your review and I hope you guys love the Aeroblade you can reach us at Rockney Pickleball on all social media channels you can email us at info at Rockney Pickleball if you have any questions um, or feedback we'd love to hear from you guys I mean this is this is how we get better and better and this is why we've got the four different pillars of paddles now because it's truly based on your requests. I wanted to introduce those of you who don't know much about Rockney Pickleball to our brand. So we started this brand in 2021. We are a family owned business and my brother and I, once we started playing pickleball, set out to find the perfect paddle and realized that we couldn't do that. We wanted to find a paddle that combined cutting edge technology with aspirational aesthetic. And we really just didn't find that out on the market at the time. 
So we set out to create it ourselves. We now, over two plus years of creating paddles and working with consultants and engineers and material experts, we now have what I like to call the four pillars of paddles. So I'm quickly gonna take you through that and then we'll end with the Aeroblade and talk about all of that technology. So we have our sub $100 line, which I think many of you know this paddle, which is the Rockney Curve Classic. We like to say this is the best second paddle you've ever had because a lot of times we start out with a crummy paddle and then you say, all right, I'm committed to the game. I need something that's going to be solid, that's gonna be durable, that's gonna last me a good while, that's going to help improve my game. And so that's where the Curve Classic comes in. This one retails for $89.99. It comes in seven different colors and we do fun special edition colors like that palm leaf back there. We did that for Saks Fifth Avenue about two years ago. So. This is a workhorse in our line, and uh, we have this one and a few others now as well in that sub $100 category. So you can get a really good paddle, great um, durability, some nice technology, and uh, commit to the game with the right tools for under 100 bucks. So this is our raw carbon line. This is the tactical. Um, this actually is a 3K raw carbon thermoform paddle. And what are those red numbers on the tactical? So 1.1, three is actually version number one. This is our first tactical paddle that's come out in a 13 millimeter. We also have this paddle available in a 16 millimeter. This is one of our hottest paddles right now. The 13 actually sold out during Black Friday. So if you go to our website right now, you're gonna see it in a pre-order because it's coming back in. The 16, get your hands on it before it sells out again. Super popular, all about spin, great combination power of control with this paddle as well. Um, if you like that, that feeling of raw carbon, if you like the spin, if you like the thermoform paddles, you're gonna love this paddle. Nice extended handle here as well for that double-handed backhand. So this is the tactical carbon and this is uh, our raw line, okay? Let me quickly take you through each of the USA made paddles. Made, manufactured, assembled, every structural component right here in the good old United States of America. This one is the fiberglass paddle. It is the 1.16. I happen to be holding the wide body. Each of the USA paddles will come in a wide body and a standard shape. It does have some nice little grittiness to it, but this is a power paddle. That is what it's all about. It's fiberglass. You know when you play with fiberglass, you get a ton of pop, a ton of power. This is the Rockne Republic 2.16 Made in America carbon paddle. So again, here are the numbers. It's the second model of our Rockne Republic line. The Republic is always going to mean fully made in the United States. 16 is the thickness, so that's 16 millimeter. So that is always measured from carbon to carbon. Um, this is a unidirectional carbon, and it is all about touch and control. This is for precision shots. This is your placement paddle. This is for all of that control. If you've got a ton of pop-ups and you're trying to control them and you don't know how, I would suggest that you give this a try. This is the standard shape, and here you can see I have the wide body shape. So nice to have a choice in case you have a preference in your shape. I, one thing I do want you to notice is actually the core. So you can see that honeycomb core through this carbon and we did that on purpose because we're actually very proud of our core. And what I want you to notice is that each and every single cell in that honeycomb is exactly and precisely the same. And why is that important? Well, it's important because if you've ever felt a dead spot on your paddle, chances are you had some crushed honeycomb. So ideally, you want your honeycomb cells to be exactly the same throughout the entire paddle so you have a similar experience when the ball hits here and when the ball hits here. The Rockne Republic 3.16 actually has a white R on it. I don't have it here with me in the office because quite frankly, I was showing it to someone, they grabbed it out of my hands, they have it. And that's just how it goes. That one is a raw carbon. It is also a unidirectional raw carbon. So the difference between that one, which is the 3.16, and this one that I'm holding that's also a unidirectional carbon is that this one has that clear coat on it. The 3.16 is a raw carbon. So if you're going for spin, if you're going for a combination paddle of power and control, then maybe you wanna pick up the 3.16. Right now it's available in the wide body. It's also going to be available in the standard um, in just a little bit here as well. You still will have that incredible honeycomb core though that you'll be able to see through the paddle and you'll be able to see that each and every singular cell is exactly and precisely the same, thus giving you 
really great precision shot. Okay, so that is the Rockne Republic line. It is fully made in the United States. Every structural component, including the carbon, we're not flying anything from overseas and assembling it here in the U.S. Everything is made here, manufactured here, assembled here, and shipped from here.